Hello, I've been in Cine Free back to another episode of Dragon Age Origins. So, we're about to speak a little bit to Alistair Morgan over here before we actually do stuff in Lodring. So, um. What do you want to talk about, Alistair? His navel, I suspect. He certainly has been contemplating it for long enough. Oh, I get it. This is the part where we're shocked to discover how you've never had a friend your entire life. I can be friendly when I desire to. Alas, desiring to be more intelligent does not make it so. Anyway, I thought we should talk about where we intend to go first. We should try and use these treaties, I assume. I agree. Have you looked at them? I have, but I haven't taken shown it on video. But there just like you get free quests. Um, one for the dwarf, one for the elves, one for the uh, circle, circle major. There are three main groups that we have treaties for. The Dalish elves, the dwarves of Orzammar, and the circle of magi. I also still think that Arleman is our best bet for help. We might even want to go to him first. Is there a way to contact the Grave Wardens? Short of leaving for Elden to seek them out, the only place to send word to would be Weisalpt Fortress. And that's thousands of miles away. What do you think we should do, Morgan? Go after your enemy directly. Find this man Loghain and kill him. The rest of this business with the treaties can then be done in safety. Yes, he certainly wouldn't see that coming, and it's not like he has the advantage of an army and experience and... I was asked for my opinion and I gave it. If your wish is to come up with reasons why something cannot be done, we will stand here until the Darkspawn are upon us. She's very true about that. Do we need to find these people? I can give you directions, if you like. So, what the Circle of Magi do at the Chantry says? Technically, the Circle of Magi is independent. We don't know that the Chantry won't support us, of course. <laughs> you truly believe that? If we speak to the first Enchanter, he should see that his responsibility to the Grey Wardens supersedes anything the Chantry or even Tan Gain might have to say about it. Uh, where would Loghain be, exactly? If he isn't out in the field with his army, he's probably going to be at the palace in Denerim. We can go to Denerim, but somehow I suspect that they're not going to let us just walk around. Only a suspicion, of course. Are we find the Dalish elves? If we head eastward, towards the Brazilian forest, we should hear word of one of the clans that wanders that area. Hopefully they will still be there. Where do we find the dwarves? We would need to speak to their king in Orzammar. That means heading west into the Frostback Mountains, which won't be easy. Where do we find Orleman? He'll be at the Castle Redcliffe, in the far western part of Ferelden, next to the mountain passes. If he isn't there, someone will be able to tell us where he is. I need more directions. Then you have a plan. Why are you leaving it up to me? Well, I don't know where we should go. I'll do whatever you decide. Now that is unsurprising. Arleman is a good man, but I don't know for sure he's where we should go. I'm not going to fight about it. I'm ready to get going. Fair enough. Let's head into the village whenever you're ready. See so yeah, there's like four main quests, which we all have to complete, be completed. Oh, to complete the game. Alright. A lot of refugees here. Stop looking at me, mongrel. I have nothing you want. Why do you keep staring at me yes. so, you, you flea ridden beast? Can you not tell when you are not wanted? I enjoy company of creatures of the wild, not stench ridden domesticated wolves. And he persists. Maddening. <laughs> oh, I love the dog. It's also a really good character. Let's speak to the farmer. You don't look like the other folk fleeing the south. Were you in the battle? 
what makes you think that. You don't look chastened, so you're not from the wilds. And you're not a farmer. I'd guess you saw some fighting. Right, so we could say we're a Grey Warden. I could say I was the King's Army. I think this guy doesn't actually trust us too much. So I think I'm gonna say number two. I thought them that survived already marched north with the Tern. You must be a survivor or a deserter. Lucky you, I guess. I should go. May I have some questions? Can't promise I'm gonna answer them. What's going on here? What isn't? We got chastened barbarians and every farmholder south of Kalanhard running from the Darkspawn. Not that they'll be safe here with the army gone. Who's in charge of this village? You could talk to the Elder. Though she's got her hands full getting everyone on their way. For now, most folks go to Sir Bryant. He's head of the Chantry's Templars. You don't have a own lord? He's gone to war and taken all his soldiers, leaving us to fend for ourselves. There's not going to be much left when he returns, if he returns. What does Bandus always do the village? Were? You mean they're gone? I'll take that as a thank you. Well, goody for you. Now there's no one to drive off the blighted refugees. Sir Brian's would be glad, though. He's been talking about offering a reward for anyone who'd run them out. I should go. Don't let me stop you. Right, I think... Refugee boy, refugee girl, refugees, Alfreds. Very well. Oh, I missed some Alfred over here. Oh, some, some crates. Over there. Right. Take that. I really need to visit the merchant. If I can find him. You there! If you're looking for safe shelter, I'll warn you, there's none to be found. Mm. I'll speak to Templarius. Move on if you can. Lothering's lost. What do you mean? We've had refugees streaming from the south for the last two days. The Chantry and Tavern are full to bursting. There simply isn't enough food to go around, and we Templars can barely keep order. You'd be better off elsewhere, my friend. Thanks for warning. Best of luck, wherever you might go. I'm just here to keep watch. I could ask questions, but I forgot to do that. Hmm. Yeah, actually, before I speak to merchants, I'm oh, going to... Oh, look how they moan and wail and gnash their teeth. It is sad to watch how helplessly they scurry about. I'm going to go I'm this cold. way. I don't like this. I'm going across the bridge. So let's talk about your mother for a moment. I'd rather talk about your mother. Well, there's nothing to talk about. And besides, isn't your mother a scary witch who lives in the middle of a forest? Much more interesting. To you, perhaps. You would find the moss growing upon a stone interesting. <laughs> you know what's more interesting than that? Apostates. Mages outside of the tower. That's illegal, you know. You did not read that in a book somewhere, did you? I hope the small letters did not strain you over much. Oh, we could not talk about your mother. That works for me. Uh, man, I love the uh, this case. Right. <clears throat> so let's head inside the Did tavern. Did you speak to that knight? Yes, there is another companion we can recruit here. Well, look what we have here, men. 
I think we've just been blessed. Uh oh, low gains, men. This can't be good. Didn't we spend all morning asking about a fellow by this very description? And everyone said they hadn't seen him. It seems we were lied to. Gentlemen, surely there's no need for trouble. These are no doubt simply more poor souls seeking refuge. They're more than that. Now stay out of our way, sister. You protect these traitors, you'll get the same as them. What makes you think we're traitors? Tern Logan claims the Grey Wardens betrayed the King. Or haven't you heard? Enough talk! Take the Warden into custody. Kill this sister and anyone else that gets in your way. Right. Let's make this quick. Yeah, let's make this quick. Um, yeah, guys. You go! Alright, that's won. a lot of surrender. Good. They've learned their lesson and we can all stop fighting now. The Grave wants to betray the King Kalen. Logan did. I was there! The turn pulled us out of a trap. The turn left the king to die. The wardens led the king to his death. The turn could do nothing. Take a message to Gain. What do you want to tell him? The Grey Wardens know what really happened. I'll tell him right away. Now, thank you. I apologize for interfering, but I couldn't just sit by and not help. It's all right. I was able to save your life. Save my life? I assure you, I can handle myself. I see. So I see. Where does a sister learn to fight like that? I wasn't born in the Chantry, you know. Many of us had more colorful lives before we joined. Let me introduce myself. I am Liliana, one of the lay sisters of the Chantry here in Lothring. Oh, I was. Merton, a pleasure. Those men said you're a Grey Warden. You will be battling the Darkspawn, yes? That is what Grey Wardens do. I know after what happened, you will need all the help you can get. That's why I'm coming along. Why so eager to come with me? The Maker told me to. Can you, uh, elaborate? I... I know that sounds absolutely insane. But it's true. I had a dream. A vision. More crazy? I thought we were all full up. Look at the people here. They are lost in their despair. And this darkness, this chaos, will spread. The Maker doesn't want this. What you do, what you are meant to do, is the Maker's work. Let me help. Very well. I will not turn away help when it's offered. Perhaps your skull was cracked worse than Mother thought. Thank you. I appreciate being given this chance. I will not let you down. Right. <coughs> so now we can change our party around. So Morgan is gonna have to... Last and damnation. Go away for a second. Indeed. We're gonna bring in Liliana. Right. Also, inventory. So let's now we can equip Liliana. Now we can now fighters that can actually show what they can equip. Glitch <laughs> there before. So she will not no longer use her rope. Instead I'll give her a subtle leather armor. And she's a rogue whose primary focus is actually bows. Even though she's got dagger equipped right now. So let's give her the wild bow, I guess. And I guess we could give her daggers as a secondary weapon. Let's see, let's give her... Since she's a rogue, I 
can give her Guildmaster's Belt. Right. Guess I can give her a Lucky Stone as well. I guess my timer. I guess can I equip her. Yeah, let's give her a Fair Wolf Charm. No, oh, wait. She actually has another thing equipped. Right. So. We're gonna have to continue in this next episode, uh, but we got another companion, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and see you guys next time. Bye!